What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Ron. I got my brother, Jay Cleave, right here. What's up? What's up? We are coming to you again with another episode of Smoke Talk. All right, we got an amazing topic for you today. But before we go to that, we're going to tell you what we're smoking and what we're drinking. All right, so I am smoking on a Drew Estate Acid Brown. Acid brand, I'm sorry. It is brown. brown. It is brown. <laughs> <laughs> acid brand, Cuba Cuba, one of my favorite cigars. My brother, what you smoking on? I am smoking on a medium body, also Drew Estate Acid brand. Brand. Cuba Maduro. Absolutely. Very, very good cigar as yes, well. Yes, sir. And we could not let the day go by. Mm without getting the new Uncle Nearest Rye Whiskey. Uncle Nearest. Shout out to Uncle Nearest, to Farm Weaver, and yes. all the good people doing over there at absolutely. Uncle Nearest. We absolutely love their products. Yes. So we're gonna try this out today. Oh yeah. All right, so our topic for the day is, maybe a shocker, on why we hate grilling. No, we, why we hate grilling. Yeah, we hate it. Mm. It just, it takes too much time to grill. Yes, absolutely. It too do. Much. Way too much time. Way too much time. I mean, too much time where we just got to chill, smoke. Especially when you have them long cooks. Long cooks. 10 plus hours. Yeah, 10 plus. Only company you have is a beer. Yeah, or a good or a good whiskey or bourbon. Still hate it. Still hate it. I mean, there's numerous reasons why. I mean, you know, the food that we get after is over. Yeah, yeah. It could be amazing, it could not be hey, amazing. By the time I'm done cooking, I'm not even hungry. Exactly. Because I've been munching while I was cooking. <laughs> Can't stand it. But everybody else that wants them, they 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 hungry. They ready to eat. But you not the one that yeah, took all cooking. that work. Uh, can I have a piece of that chicken? Yeah, yeah. Always want something. Always. Oh, but you know, and then and then you got to look at all the different ways of grilling and understanding yep. airflow and just the all intricacies that come with grilling uh, itself. Uh. And you know, and then you got a setup. We got a video. We gotta produce all this good content. I know for the people. Yeah. So it's like so many reasons why we hate grilling. But what is one? But what is the main reason why you hate grilling? The main reason I hate grilling. I would say the main reason I hate grilling is that for them long cooks, how early we gotta get up. <laughs> five a.m. God don't call me to get up at five a.m. But you know. That's what, that's what we got to do with the long cooks. What about you, my brother? Man, speaking of long cooks, we're about to do a yeah, long cook next week. I know, and it's going to be a process. Am, yeah. What What about you, my brother? For what's me? You, yeah, what's the reason why? I hate fighting my grill <laughs> <laughs> in different temperatures and different weathers. Yeah, yeah. Like to fight my grill or using different types of charcoals. Yes. Uh, I won't. I will. I will. Uh, I, the, the one I hate will remain nameless. Yes. So I won't even mention that because yeah. sometimes you just keep buying it. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Relax. We've known better. We've known better. Hey. <laughs> That's another reason why I hate grilling. Sometimes you just don't know better. You just don't know better. You, you keep, just don't know better. You get insane because you keep doing the same thing and expecting a different result. I'm going to keep buying this same charcoal. I'm, hey, listen, <laughs> I've gotten some different results, but this is why I hate grilling. Yeah, we got, we got, we got something to work out. But it don't seem like it's too bad to grill. <laughs> <laughs> now, I love it. Out of all that, it may not, <laughs> may not be too bad. <laughs> out of all those things, I love grilling. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you know, we, 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 we sitting there joking around. We don't hate grilling. We love it. Love it. It's a lot of annoyance that can come with it. Absolutely. But we absolutely love it. It's our zen. It's our getaway. I enjoy drinking and, um, and whether it's whiskey or drinking a beer and even the long cooks I enjoy because it allows for fellowship just to yes. sit there talking, just you know, dialogue with one another. Absolutely. Um, so I definitely, I definitely love that. And I don't mind when people come up to ask for for some food when I'm cooking. You wanna know why? They about to taste the master's cooking. You know what I'm saying? Like, how that tastes? Oh, it's is good, Uncle Josh. Hey, there you go. Yeah, it's amazing. So, mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. Oh, you do that kid voice. When this you is good, that. Uncle Josh. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got to add a little animation in there. Okay, yeah. you got to add the animation in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh, too, too much right. of a laugh. Oh, no, it's all good. Oh, it's, it's all good, good my brother. Cool. It's smoke talk. We cool. something light today, but no, all serious. All seriousness, people, we love grilling. I mean, all those negative ways that we just talked about, yes, it can be time consuming. Yes, there's a lot to learn about Absolutely. grilling as you get more into it. Yes, there's different types of grills right. that some are more insulated than others. 
there's different types of charcoal yep. that do better than others and sometimes we still get not so good ones but i won't i won't go on that i won't go on that no more you know that we got <laughs> that we just gotta gotta learn and evolve and we and we get better as we go so in all seriousness we love grilling and honestly all those things that you mentioned those are the reasons why we do love grilling like we love different grills because even though they can be challenging sometimes, that's where we, it allows you to be strategic, to, to, to learn how to master that particular grill. It's like, yes. it's a good challenge to take on. Yep. And we love to take on challenges. So all those reasons why we say we hate is really the reasons why we love grilling. Yep. And for those of you who have never grilled before, we will highly encourage and implore you to get a grill, get a charcoal grill and to grill, to learn it because it, it's very peaceful. It's such a Zen and you, it's, it's, it's very therapeutic. Yes, it is. Um, so we encourage you, get a grill. You know, look at our look at our channels, look at our episodes, and see how we grill certain things to, to really pick up a different hobby, you know? Yes. It's cool, especially during the summer times. It's a great way to bring family together, um, friends together, to dialogue, to fellowship. So, yeah, this is why we actually love grilling. Yes. And you should, too. Yes, you should, too. And you point you did you pointed out something good right there, brother, with the charcoal grill. Start off with a charcoal grill. Don't go straight to gas or pellet or gravity or nothing like that. And while this plane go by, I'ma still explain it to you. Charcoal grill actually gives you into that mindset of I'ma focus on this. I'm gonna see how this works. Yep. It, it, it makes you work for the end result right. of just getting a great cut of a great some great food that you're gonna be cooking on Absolutely. that grill. Absolutely. And you and you can actually sit there and take time in doing it. All those other grills kind of do it for you. And yeah. it, it takes the fun out of it to me, you know, in yep. all seriousness. But then as you get more comfortable with a charcoal grill, then you step yourself up to something else. Yep, start and upgrading. You, yes, and then you can upgrade to something where you can just set and forget it, but at least you know, if you lose electricity, that you still know how to cook some food on the grill. Absolutely, because you can literally cook anything on a grill that you can cook Inside on a stove and oven. It's, it's literally in an oven, mm -hmm. but outside. Absolutely. You know. It's better. The flavor tastes better because you know you got the charcoal, got the different flavors from the charcoal and the wood. Yeah. But like you said, you always have your go-to for anything happen with the electricity. Yep. Absolutely. Unless you have a gas stove, then you can still cook without that's electricity. True. That's true. But that's a whole another topic. But yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, everyone. We appreciate you all watching this episode. But now it's for the our most favorite part of the episode: the taste test oh, of yeah. this good old Uncle Nearest. Rye whiskey. Listen, I already know it's good on Canaries. You never fail. Yeah, you never fail. But we're going to try it out. Really? Here we go. And you know, rye's my favorite. Ooh. Yo. Oh. Oh. I taste Do it again. Hold on. Let me tell me what you taste. Let, one more again. One more I'm again. Already, I'm already analyzing what's in Oof. it. Goodness gracious. Sold. Uncle Nearest. You did your thing. Mm. You did your thing with this one. There's some rides that I've had, but that's probably far by far by far one of the best the ones best. I've tasted. Absolutely. That's good. It's good. It's yeah. smooth. Mm. It's smooth, it's bold, but it's smooth. Out. What am I getting on the back end? It's like it, it seems like it was aged in some type of like some type of wine barrel or something like mm. that. It has a like sweet but the sweetness taste doesn't it come up yeah. front, it's no. like in the back. Yeah, it's like once you, you're, you're, you're tasting you're swallowing it, you can taste the sweetness. Oh, man. Wow. Wow. Oh. All right. This has been another great episode of Smoke Talk. Oh, yeah. We're going to just continue sipping on this good old rye whiskey and smoking these cigars. And we hope you do, too. Take some time out to enjoy yourself, enjoy life. And we're going to see you all on the next time. See you next time. Peace. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> We ain't playing that. We're in the money. <laughs> yes, we are. We're in the money.